by the Proud Boys, the Ku Klux Klan, uh, the Nazis, the skinheads. Are they plugged up in this courtroom? Do we know the history of this judge? I heard he's been racist as hell to meet these people in Kenosha for many years. Do we know his background? Mr. Blake. Listen, we got thick skin. We've been my great-grandfather, my grandfather. We've been fighting this for years and my father. And we're going to keep fighting till we win. It's up to the red, black, and green unity now. Mr. Blake, we're live, we're live on MSNBC. What did you make of Mr. Rittenhouse's argument of self-defense? There was no self-defense. Self-defense is when you're protecting your home. If you're protecting your family, he, in a very bastardly and dastardly way, used the law that worked for him. There was absolutely no self-defense. So, Chuck, there you have it. Uh, just what Blake, uh, Jacob Blake's uh, uncle speaking to reporters back there. Um, he is obviously uh, very disappointed. Now, keep in mind, apparently there was at least one black juror. So was that one black juror pressured by the white jurors into finding him not guilty on all five counts? Or maybe just maybe the black jurors and the non-black jurors agreed? This thing on? I'm surprised he wasn't called the black face of white supremacy. But then I guess Winsome Sears has already taken that title. She took it from me. So I guess it gets handed down. Lieutenant Governor of Wisconsin. Over the past few weeks, many dreaded the outcome we just witnessed. You dreaded five unanimous verdicts of not guilty. Why did you dread it? And you think saying something like that might be incendiary? Might cause some people to engage in protests and riots, which is exactly why Calvert and House went there in the first place? How ironic. Irresponsible statements being made by public figures making violence more likely, and it was the violence that prompted Kyle Rittenhouse to come there in the first place. Is this thing on? Now, jurors don't have to speak. They can if they want to. It'll be very interesting to find out what happened, whether there was a holdout, who the holdout was. If there was a black juror, as apparently has been reported, what did he or she think? Triple eight nine seven one S H E. Your calls about the not guilty verdicts in the Kyle Rittenhouse case. When we come back. Triple eight nine seven one S H G E. I'm Larry Elder.